Hey guys, it's Epic here. Today I'm going to be doing an unboxing of the Ignite Black Ops 1911 um, Scorpion Full Metal Full Metal um, Scorpion Pistol. Here's the specs. It's got semi-auto, 12 gram, which I just um, I just got crossman. Uh, 20 round mag. That's metal. A uh, full, a full side blowback for real feel. It's got full metal pistol. A classic 1911 style, professional airsoft grade. This is $65 at my local Walmart. Um, max velocity 450 with 12 gram BBs, which I'm assuming it's around 350 with .20s. Um, turn it upside down. Same facts, adjustable hop up for an increased distance. Uh, you can pause that if you want. Common Mac trigger, classic design and function. Um, 12 gram, powerful. It's got ambidextrous thumb safety, handle grip safety with protective um, beaver tail. Combination fail safes for added protection and comfort. Um, it's got excellent blowback for real fail, adjustable real sights, and a metal barrel. So let's go ahead and open this. I've heard a lot of. Hold on, sorry. Let me just open up my knife. Uh, let's get that out. I've heard a lot of good stuff about this gun. Um, and some bad stuff. So I thought I'd give it a try. Let me set you guys up here. Just while I'm cutting this. Okay. Alright, let me just open up these tabs. Again, 65. It was 75, so it depends on your Walmart. Mine, it was. Alright, here we go, folks. Alright, I got it like that. Um, let's go ahead and open this up. Okay, look at that. Woo! That's nice. Okay, came with some foam pieces to keep it from wiggling around. Yeah, metal. Just the mag. Look at that. Like that. Like that, guys. Uh, this is a very heavy mag, actually. Whew, this is heavy. Let me go get the scale, actually. Hold on. I'm sorry. Just right around here. Oh. That's not. Never mind. But it's pretty heavy. Um, I don't know how heavy that that is, but that's heavy, jeez. For a mag? That's heavy. Yeah. And the CO2 goes right in here, and then you screw it on like that. Let me take off the cap, so you just get your mag, and you pull this thing up, and that reveals your CO2, which you can unscrew, and... Yeah, this is heavy. I don't know. There you go. Screw it back on. Put in the CO2. And then you're ready. Sorry, I'm screwing this thing back on. Trying not to cross the thread. Alright. Put that on. And then your cover cap just slides right back on. It's only got two... Um, Plastic parts, I'm not even sure how this thing goes on. Okay, this is my first CO2 pistol. I have a GNG, CM16 Raider. Put in the comments if you want to see a review of that. Let me just look at something real fast. So yeah, this mag is heavy. It's like a pound, seriously. But yeah. There's that. Uh, let me just check one more thing in the mag, looks like. Alright. So, yeah, that's a heavy mag. That's heavy. It's metal. Yeah, it's metal. I don't have a magnet, but it's metal. Just trust me on that one. Um, it didn't come with any warnings. I just noticed that. Because it had warnings and stuff on reviews that I've watched, and there's nothing in the box, so... 
Put in the comments if you think it's a defect or a return. It's not a return, obviously, because everything's good in it. So here's the gun. Take it out. It's heavy. Um, set everything aside. Oh, is this? Oh, whoops. I'm stupid. I'm sorry. Um, came with the warranty. Apparently, I put that off at the side because I'm excited. And that's your warranty. 30 days. Came with a catalog of Ignite. Ignite Airsoft. Here's what we got. You know what I got. 20 rounds holding the mag. <clears throat> and all their other guns. And here's their manual. So here's the gun. Here's the gun, guys. This is metal. <laughs> yeah, that's cool. It's got a plastic flash hider and the only has four plastic parts. It's got the threaded barrel that's plastic. It's got the grips, their ABS, um, this tip that's plastic right in here, and then this cap that's plastic. That's it. Um, there's not a lot of lube on this gun, actually. I don't know, but um, let's go ahead and bring this thing back up here. So I'm really excited. I've been saving up for this. So 65, I got CO2. You see that? It's got a nice logo on there. So that's cool. Wow. Look at that. <laughs> that's cool. Yeah, it's got a metal barrel. That's cool. Holy cow. Okay, so when you rack the side back, let's see if I can do this one hand. When there's the BBs are empty, it will automatically engage back like this. I will be doing, it's got that logo, like I said, I will be doing a review on this soon. Um. Oh, it's got foam, I forgot to blow that out, hold on. Um, you see an ejection port here. It's got your warnings. It's got three safeties. So, um, you got your grip safety here. Which you have to have that held down to shoot. You got your thumb safety that's ambidextrous on both sides. And you got your hammer safety. People don't know about this. Oh, yeah, it's got skeletonized trigger and hammer. Pull back halfway. Like on the real 1911, it won't pull the trigger all the way. Engage it. Sorry, let me pull it back. And it will shoot. That's cool. Um, yeah, so that's my unboxing. Thank you guys for watching. It's got it's a really nice gun. It's really heavy, about two or three pounds. So like, subscribe, and comment. I'm gonna be doing. Um, some more videos on this about shooting and review. So, yeah, guys. Bye.